African Republic. The medical men are on the pitch. This program is organized by the Language Clinic, Zillinets.com, and proudly sponsored by Agushi Global Vision, Flash Info, Alisa Hotel, Zenet Bank, and Sky Digital Television, the only digital television covering this program live. Go get your digital television sets. That's the Sky Digibals, and you have this program live on it. The Mega Francophone Tournament of the Year, that's the TLC Cup 2010. This is the match between the Chadian and the Central African Republic. Referee whistle and the player passes the ball. Whoa, whoa! Referee says it's an offside. It's an offside. Referee Samuel Lili calls for the player. And I think it's going to caution him that whenever you hear the whistle, never touches the ball. No matter where you are, if the whistle is being blown, just stop. The skipper of the Central African Republic, the number 13 man, got injured and is now back. The first the ball has been headed out. The Central African is having the ball. Oh, what a poor pass. The defense. Referee Samuel Lili says that is a stamp. And for that matter, it's a foul ball. In the FIFA rules of the game, fouls and misconduct. He's lucky he's gone scot free without taking any card from referee Samuel Lili. Junior. The game is fantastic. It has been kicked in. Yes. And the defender headed the ball out to the man, number 10 man, who has been a threat. The ball has been kicked out for a throw in. It's a nice game. Fantastic game. Both teams have not disgraced themselves at all. Even though the Chardens are leading by four goals to two, I think they've both played well and they deserve some applause from the supporters. It's a game that needs to be watched and watched again. So get your sky, beat the box, and you'll watch this game over and over. Sky Digita, add value. It's bringing you this match at your various homes. Various offices, workshops, everywhere. On Sports 24, that's Channel 24. Watch this on Sports Channel 24. Sky Digital, add value. It's the only digital television station that is covering this mega francophone tournament of the year. That's the TLC Cup 2010, organized by... The Language Clinic and Zillinet.com. Sky, add value. It's a throw in. The ball has been kicked out of play. And I believe the players will do everything possible to get the two goals to tally up to make 4 4 for a drunk game. But I believe referee substitution to be done by the Chadians. The technical bench have seen some weak points in their area, so they will call for a new legs to come in. The number 40 man is going out for his brother to come and help his team for the victory. The supporters are here in their numbers to support their team to victory. The Chadians are really, really having fun because they are leading by four goals to two. What a nice play. The ball goes out for two.
the front, the Central African Republic are doing everything possible to get their two goals scored. What a nice clear by the Central African Republic. They throw the ball, hairs goes up, the defender brings the ball, kicks in a long one, what a back heel pass. The ball, both teams are trying to play the one on one, but the Central African Republic are still with the ball, moving one, referee says foul ball, he missed the ball and he went in for the man. If you miss the ball, don't miss the man, it's was the player went in for. Referee Samuel Lili is really in control of the game, making sure that both teams go home without injury. It's a free kick to the Central African Republic. He kicked the long one and the ball goes in. The ball goes out for a goal kick. You can watch this match on Sky the Guitar Channel Sports 24. The official TV digital television broadcaster of this tournament. The Chadians are with the ball. The one on one. The ball goes out for two against the Central African Republic. The Chadians had a drunk game with the Nigerian. And then the Chadian, the Central African Republic had a drunk game with the Nigerian. And the Chadian won against the Cameroon by five goals to one. That was an opportunity by being blocked by the defense of the Central African Republic. I beg your pardon, the Central African Republic had a drunk game with the Nigerian. And then the Chadian beat the Cameroon by five goals to one. And I believe that they're still having the spirits by winning this very game. The supporters share the view that their team is going to take the trophy at the end of the tournament, which will take place at the Ohinijan Sports Stadium, come on the 11th of December, 2010. It's a corner kick and the number 10 shattered man substitution down by the Central African Republic. Two players at a time. The number 14 man is coming in for the number 6 man and then number 10 man comes in for the number 17 man I believe. These new legs will add something to the Central African Republic attacking machinery and then the defense. He kicks the ball in and the ball runs. It has been headed oh. The player stood to his feet and headed the ball across the bar. Wow, what a rough tackle from the Martin man. He should be careful because he's already in the books of Reverend Sami Lily Jr. He has already received a yellow card. The next card that he will receive, he will visit the restroom to take early shower of the game. Referee says, calm down because this is a friendly game to unite all Africans, not to hurt your, your neighbor. Be careful, be careful, referee Samuel Lili Jr. says. They kick the ball. The ball has been headed by the defender. They are caught by watching. The Italians are playing very well. The Central African Republic playing the one on one. And Matema comes for the ball. He breaks the ball, trying to take the place on the dummy. But he feels he has been. Oh, what a tackle. Supporters are shouting for yellow card and red card. But referee says, no, I'm the final sayer on the pitch. 
They are saying the player deserves it. It's a foul ball. He kicks the ball. Trying to take the players. The ball goes for a goal kick. Two players on the turf. I don't know if it's a drama. They all went on the ground at this, on the pitch and got up. The medical team are there to make sure he gains his fitness back. The match is getting bigger, better and brighter. Both sides are doing well. The Central African Republic gets a goal kick. What a poor kick. The ball beats the Chadian. He blocks the ball to the Central African Republic. The number nine man don't know what to do with the ball. The ball has been intercepted by the number six Chadian. He goes with the ball. The number ten man is everywhere on the pitch. Swinging from defense to attack to wings. He has been booked. He has been brought down. But everything is play on. He goes back for the ball. And the Matema gets the ball back. The one on one is really working. The ball has been headed back. Two players, lack of communication is there. The ball is still in play. The Central African Republic was waiting for the ball, but the ball was cleared. It's a ding dong affair, moving from one side to the other. What a run kick! Oh, he couldn't get his foot to the ball. I think the players are tired. They can no longer run with the ball, especially the Italians. You can see them that they are really, really tired. A referee, Samuel Lily, has also for an infringement over there for an indirect free kick. The ball has been headed. He was waiting for the ball. Oh, oh, ow, 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 ow. The player has been kicked. From behind, I don't know what referee Samolili is doing. That's tacking from behind. He gets his foot to the calf of the player, and he's on the turf, screaming, screaming, rolling on the turf. The medical men are there to treat him. This tournament is organized by. The language clinic of the year, the TLC Cup 2010, and it is and it's been sponsored by Zenit Bank, Global Vision Limited, and Flash Info Sky right from the beginning to the end. So go get yourself. So go get yourself the Digibox and watch all this live on the Sky Sports 24. That's to their players to get on and win the match. <laughs> Referee, I spotted some infringement there.